all the methodologies, like before AI, we're talking the before AI age now, they are based on the trial and error nature. What it means? Yeah, it means we, we introduce as many mutations in a genotype of bacteria as possible in the structural gene, and then we see, and then we're hoping to find the one that works. And this cycle is very long, right? So we need to uh, synthesize those peptides, we need to uh, inject them, we need to inject um, vectors for um, uh, transferring the gene into the bacteria. Then we need to get this protein, then we need to measure its function, and um, it's a difficult and uh, time-consuming way. So there is no fast way and there is no general way. Every story is unique. So most of the time it's just brute forcing experimental library screening. Also, during all of this process, we are not learning on our mistakes. Um, every new set of mutagenesis may introduce and definitely introduces past errors. There is no way to deal with that. It is just how it works. We cannot limit it. So there will be a lot, a lot of failed attempts. And of course, people who do it will pay for these attempts. AI is the right tool to help in these circumstances.